my channel. I have another beauty haul here for you today. I have some pharmacy goodies, some from Sephora, and even Target. So if you want to see what I have been picking up, again, keep on watching. Okay, you guys, so not in any random order. We are just going to go through it. I have it in this little plastic bag because sometimes I get to where I forget what it is I'm buying at that time. And then I end up putting them aside and I forget to put them in my haul. Or they just, I don't know, they end up somewhere. Else. So I put them in the little bag. I know it looks like a gratis haul. I wish I was so lucky to work at Sephora, but I don't. So let's just go ahead and get into the haul. Um, I don't have any place to sit anything. I gotta go back and forth, you guys. Um, this is a men's cologne, and I did get this from Pharmacy. It is, I'm probably gonna butcher this, you guys, no joke. Um, I'm not even gonna try to say it. We're just gonna let you read it, okay? Because your girl is always bitching something around here. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the bottle. And um, this is, I think, I wanna say like $35 or $36. But it smells amazing. My husband loves it. It kind of reminds me, I don't know if you guys remember that one perfume that I think it was made by LaCrosse. Sephora used to carry it, I think. That's what this reminds me of. It's not very strong, kind of soft, but God, is it manly. Mm, I mean, that just smells amazing, you guys. Amazing. <laughs> oh, did I show you guys the bottle just in case I did not? Here it is right here. It smells so, so good, you guys. So, so good. It is by the brand Pharmacy. It's F-A, not the P-H. That's what this one is by. And this is, there's a lot of stuff that I have here that is from that brand. I really want to kind of like sit this over here, but then I have to keep turning. Like I have, I have no room, you guys. I really don't. Um, this is called Madame. This is a woman's perfume and they do have a men's version of this one. I do believe it's supposed to be like the same concept as far as smells goes. Of course though, that one would be manly and not so soft like this one. This one here smells so good, you guys. I had read the notes on the website for this one and it. I will list the, in, the insert a picture here of the notes because I can't remember all I think I think one was orange tangerine and it had musk and all that good stuff I honestly don't remember word for word what all the notes were but this just smells so good and I know I keep saying that because I said that about the first one but it just smells so good it has you can smell that musk I don't really smell like the orange scent or any of that I do smell the musk but it's not like oh grandma or anything like that it's very like sophisticated kind of classy and I don't know, it just screams fall to me. I really, really love this one. And once again, that is by the brand Pharmacy. It's a gorgeous little bottle. I do believe this one was $39.90, which is very cheap for a perfume. It does last throughout the day. And I'm obsessed with it. I love it, you guys. It smells so good. I know I want to get a couple more perfumes from um, that brand. Of course, why wouldn't I? Um, I do have one thing here. You guys, you guys, I need some room. I did pick up one thing from the 21 Days of Beauty. This here was originally $50 and it was on sale that day for $25 and it is Dermalogica Calm Water Gel and it is, let's see, smoothing lightweight moisture. It does have hyaluronic acid. Is that what it is? I know, I, yeah. I'm so confused today, you guys. But yeah, I think it does have that in there. I will list, I will insert a picture and list it for you guys, but I'm pretty sure that's what I read. Let's see. Formulated. Hydrate. Dry skin. Sensitive skin. Water gel. I don't know. I'll list it in here somewhere because I don't want to hold up the video. But, and this is the little box that it comes in. And it does go on like a water cream, you guys. It's very nice. Like your face feels a little wet, which is in a good way, not a bad way. And, um... Once it goes in, and I even did this with my makeup on, so it doesn't affect your makeup in any way. I have already used it, and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like real quick. Normally, if it says gel, you're going to think it comes out like a gel, but this in here is like a gel cream, and this is what the tube looks like. It does have that little lid right there, so you just close that back up, put that back together, and that's what that looks like. But let me see if I can show you real quick. I have a swatch, so... Don't mind that, but 
it does feel a little watery for probably the first few minutes but after that you guys I promise you will love this stuff it is amazing and I've been having a lot of dry skin and the first day that I got it because my hands are so dry because I'm always sanitizing or washing them they were really dry and I put this on my hands and it was like I have new skin you guys no joke it is just look at that it is really nice product so if you guys didn't get it at the 20 way days of beauty for $25 I'm sorry but it's amazing and you really need that product you really do especially if you have dry skin like me I don't know where I'm going here with it let's see it's on this side the next product I have here is just a little boring item and I know I already had one but guess what in my last video I was talking about the Sephora haul that never showed up and I got a refund so now I need to contact Sephora because I ended up getting it and I'm definitely gonna want to keep this so um, it is just their uh, cleansing gel it's a cleanse and toner i love it i use it on face eyes i don't use it on my neck because i'm always using something else in the shower for my neck but i do use this on my eyes it does not irritate your eyes at all and it's just like a jelly cleanser which i have said before it kind of reminds me of the one from drunk elephant and this is like it's getting so washed out and it's like a ten dollar version of that one so you are saving like i think 22 dollars. i think that one's 32 so why not? Am I right, you guys? You want to save the money. This stuff is amazing, and it's so inexpensive. Uh, the next thing I got from Sephora was a much-needed product that I ran out a while back, and I'm so excited to have it in my life, and it is the Clinique Take the Day Off Balm. And I know we all know this, but I'm going to go ahead and show you. I haven't even checked this one time. I got one from Sephora. And it had like fingerprints in it, but thank goodness this one does not. It is just a white balm. I really do like this. I don't necessarily like taking off my makeup with just a wipe, a makeup removing wipe. I like to go home with something like this. I'll probably, I might end up doing like the makeup wipe and then going in with this or vice versa. It just depends on what type of makeup I have on. Like if I have on the Estee Lauder wear, the double wear, I'll probably end up going in with this first and then going in with the makeup wipe, then going in with the Marcella water and the eye makeup remover. I just have so many steps in my uh, take my makeup off kind of thing. I think I should really do a get on ready with me so I can show you guys exactly what I am doing so it doesn't seem so confusing because I do use a lot of products and this is a must have you guys. I've had it so many times. I've probably been using that for like over two years, no joke. That's how obsessed I am with it. The next two things that I have here are just some lashes, and this is uh, Lexi, I guess I'm saying that right, I don't know, <laughs> Lash Kit, and uh, this is just by e.l.f., and they're so cute and so inexpensive. These ones here are like $4, you guys, no joke. They are like, I'm trying to get the right angle, but they are just so gorgeous. I wanted to wear them today with this look because I haven't had any lashes, so I'm just doing mascara, you guys, but I cannot wait to put these on. They are so pretty, 4 bucks at Target. Uh, the next pair I also got at Target, and these are Adele's. These are just uh, the Wispies. These are a little bit more dramatic, which I have a couple looks coming up that I want to do for Halloween. And I thought, you know, I really need these. And my bobby pin is, like, falling out of my hair, you guys. But these are freaking pretty, too. And I couldn't make in my mind. I thought for, like, a more natural type makeup, those would be good. And then, like, when I'm doing my Halloween looks or, like, my glam looks, these would even be better. I'm really starting to get into makeup a little more than what I used to. I'm trying new colors, new things, and I'm just so excited. And I need the lashes to go with them. You cannot do those looks without lashes, right guys? Okay, so the next one I have here um, is by Pharmacy, and this is an Autumn Story number 12. And I wanted this for a little while, you guys, and I could not wait to get my hands on it. It is gorgeous, and let me tell you, I have not worn this with a look yet. Um, it is gorgeous, and one thing I like about these is that these do not move. I hope, let's see, we'll put it about right there. Uh, when they dry down, and we're going to go over the one I have on my lips, but when these dry down, they do not go anywhere. So I have tried to remove them with dish, um, Dawn dish soap. They would not remove. Later that night, I was trying to take off my makeup, and I just used one of the pharmacy makeup removing wipes. Took it right off. Kid you not, but it would not come off with dish soap, okay? And this is the color. I'm so bad with this. I needed to go over this way, but that is the color right there. It is gorgeous, and these are liquid lipsticks, and they do not move. They do not move. I'm not even joking. Um, let's see. I want to show you the, the liner that I got to go with that one. And this is in, is this the right one? Yes, this is in 222. Maybe this would be better if I go right here. 
but I do want to make a little mark right there so you can see that it goes with it. I'm horrible at swatches. I'm not even joking. That is the 222 liner, and I think it's going to go perfect with Autumn Story. It, it matches really good, you guys. I did good. I'm not used to picking out liners with lipsticks, lipsticks but I did good on my own on that one. Because I had another one in mind that I was going to get. I was like, no, 222 looks like a good fit, and I was right, too. So we have that. This liner that I got, and these are by Pharmacy, you guys. The liner that I have in this one is 212. And I got this because I have Sweet Cherry that I hauled in my last beauty haul. And that is going to match perfectly. Which one is it? It's the one right here on top. Let me make that a little darker just so you guys can see. Was it up top? I don't know, you guys. But I'm just going to draw it out for you. That is the one I got to go with Sweet Cherry. I think it's going to match perfectly. Um, moving right along. The next color I have from Pharmacy, and this is also a liquid lipstick. Let me show you. And it is the one I have on my lips today. Very pretty color. And the good thing about these is I'm not wearing a liner. You don't really need a liner. They go on your lips perfectly. You can pretty much draw the line right there, and they don't move. They don't budge. I'm going to go ahead and swatch this, even though I have it on my lips today, just so we can show what it looks like on the skin. And it's so weird. This one here is called Skin, you guys. It's called Skin, and it is number 201. Let me show you that one. It's that one right here. It's pretty true to color, right? Very pretty. I love that one. I love it. Um, the next item I have here, I do have a couple of Morphe brushes right here. And we are going to go with this one first. Let's see what this one says. This is just a firm shadow brush. I really need this. I have been learning that you need to pack on shadows because I'm not even going to lie to you guys before I just go and I, I have been packing it on lately which is really cool because it gives a lot more pigment. I'm trying to see if this has a number. Yes, it is M126 for this one. And I love how it's just silver down here and black up here. It's just so pretty. That's going to be amazing to use, I think. I will let you guys know if I love it, if I hate it. Or if it's just okay. And the next brush that I have here is... What is this one for? I forgot what it was. Just a crease brush. 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 <laughs> I'm telling you guys, I cannot talk today. It's horrible. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh, I can get it out. We're going to see what it looks like. So this one is M431. And it kind of looks like that. I think it's going to be amazing to get up in your crease. Just like get up in that little area right there. I think it's going to be perfect to smooth all that out. It is a cute little brush. I see the point. I feel like I have to have that one. Okay, so the next two items that we have here are just some freebies from Sephora. From the order that I placed online. And this one is Versace. Is it? I don't know. I'm all, People quote me on that saying I'm saying it wrong. I don't know. But that's what I'm going to say. And... Let's see, what is scent is this? You know, guys, I think this is for a man. Yeah, it says, um, I don't even know where the, where is the name at? I don't know if that's it or not, but that's what that looks like. And on the inside, it looks like this. So we have that one, and then we have one million. I haven't smelt this one before. I know this one is for men, I do believe. So I'm going to pass these on to my husband. And that's what that looks like. So yes, guys, that is it. This is my entire haul. I felt like I had so much more than that, to be honest. But that is it. So that's it for this video. I'm going to leave all of my links down below so you can check out Pharmacy. I will try to list all the products that you've seen in this video today. And with that being said, if you have not yet subscribed, please subscribe. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day wherever you are. And until next time, bye guys.